what, what are you thinking about battle rap right now? Just generally. I think it's in a weird place where it's probably better than it's ever been, but more underappreciated. Okay. Because the views are lower, attendances are, at some events are lower, mm. but technically the writing and the, the entertainment's as much as it's ever been. Yeah, man. Bigger. So it's an odd place, but I think it's a healthy place. I think there's a lot of competition, a lot of people coming through still, a lot of different leagues doing different things mm-hmm. and different styles and yeah. doing their own things. So I think it's in a good place and I think there's opportunities out there for people. So that's right. And it's still for me the the hub of lyricism in the world right now. I think the best writers in rap are battling right now. Okay. So that's my opinion. And I think punches and the complexity behind what, what they're writing is completely above rap music and other forms of spoken word rap kind of lyricism. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. so I think it's in a good place. Yeah, man. So what you, what, what's, who would you like to battle next now? Who would I like to battle yeah. next? Um, oh. So the obvious one for me is Shock, because I know he's become champion, but that's been a while, and that's definitely a battle that's going to happen. So um, okay. that's sort of just uh, something that's going to happen at some point, because we both won it. Um, I'd love to do that battle. I think shots would be a great battle. Would that be a title shot though? Would that be a title match? It would be a title match. Mm, no, it, it be a title match. Um, I don't think I deserve a title match, and I don't think I'd be given that as a title match. Um, I'm going to say, so shots definitely, I think that'd be a great battle. I think beating him non title, as long as I win it, like, I don't care. I'm just uncompetitive with this, with this. I wouldn't do it if it wasn't, if we're just sitting there saying I'm asking each other. Yeah, yeah, yeah of course. Yeah, this is competitive. So all I care about is beating him because then. People will go, oh yeah, he beat Shocks and he's a champion, so it don't really matter about the title, he's just, that's how we be you know what I mean? Do yeah. so you think you can beat Shocks, yeah? Um, on my best day, stepping up, yeah, definitely. Oh, that, I think, I think I can out, well he's a great writer, but I think I can out, right? Yeah, and I think um, it's just about matching his performance and his aggression, or trying to counter that and diffuse it. So it's just about finding the angles and the approach. Okay. Um, so if I ever come around to that, I'm not thinking about it until it happens, but um, that'd be that'd be cool to do. I'd like to battle. I think Quill would be a really good battle. Cool, a lot of people yeah. mentioned that. Yeah, oh, like as, a, as a sort of stylistic thing, mm-hmm. Quill would be good. I'm not looking to battle many people. Like if something gets offered, then it's the right thing. Like I would hate to come across as arrogant or someone who thinks oh only certain people are worthy because it's not like that. Anyway, you have like it's about it's all about making the, the the right clashes happen. And you know when I was coming up. I got a win against Jay Shaw. He didn't necessarily have a, he didn't have a reason. He didn't have to prove anything against me. He was just like, oh yeah, I like him. I think he's good. So I'm gonna. Yeah, that was a good battle. And sometimes you need Very to. Very close one as well. Yeah, exactly. And sometimes you just need to. It's just about the clashes. So, um, but at the same time, like sometimes like, I get a message off with someone and I'm just like, definitely not battling them because I've done ten free rounders now. That I've got flocked. Frankie was my tenth free rounder. Mm-hmm. Um, I don't feel like taking a clear loss. Even though there's debatable, like you say, like people can let and people are gonna debate things, but I know it's like clearly gone just you know what I mean? So I think it held my own, I think I've earned my stripes and I'm just looking to do like good clashes now, less regularly, but you know, shocks, quill, anyone I'd like to battle a couple internationals, I battled X Q Z, he's great, he's not a big name necessarily, I don't think he turned up that much for that battle. Um so yeah, people, like if a good international comes around, like next time one of these events is on, like Someone like just a good, a good writer, like Joe Knight or someone like that, you know, I think someone like him would be a wicked battle. So, what about the other leagues you came to? I'll give to the girl, uh, there's a dub, stick, uh, dub scandal, the new league, yeah, I think there's if, one in Ireland now. If it's the right names, then yeah, yeah. okay, I think if it's someone that like I rate highly, then yeah. I mean, even doing KLTR, like I've done one battle in King of the Ronalds just because I wanted to battle there, like I fuck with them a lot, you know, I've. I've Supported them and they got the lazy ass won that and decision. And, yeah, and lazy ass Shaq again, a newcomer coming up. I what think, do you think of lazy ass Oh, I think um, the way it's going now, lazy ass Jack and Scoop will be the next birthday weekend's newcomer here battle. Them two. Okay. Yeah, about because if, if lazy ass Jack can can stop stumbling, which he will because he's just not prepped enough. Mm. His bars, he's got some really nice writing. Yeah, it is. He can he's like, sort of he's focus delivered. less on the heavy, heavy breakdown, because I think that's sort of had its day, even I was doing a little bit more of that in my early day, I think that's had its day, like, I think what's popping in battle now is punching, making people laugh, and he can do all that, so I think if he refines his style and keeps, I think he's battling Bizzo soon, again Bizzo's a writer, a really great, so that's really a good battle, so um, 
I think, yeah, I battled him in Daisy because I was like, you know what, he's a good writer. He's, he's winning the KLTR um, roster. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think it will be a good clash. And yeah, it was it was nice to battle him. But yeah, I think he's someone who's on the up and definitely wants to win. I don't think there's a lot of people coming through now, actually. Uh, who are you if, compare the, if you compare it to like, the 2015 era, no. um, there's a new new music. I, I don't think there's a many like tryouts coming through now. Like, well, Scoop had a big, great tryout. Scoop. Yeah. Lazy Ass Jack's been doing bits on on Don't Flop and KLTR. I don't. Sorry. Off the top of my head, I'm. Uh, I'll chuck some in. Rivers. I don't see Rivers as a newcomer. Uh, no, I'm saying, what do you think of him? Rivers is wicked. Yeah. Yeah, Rivers. Rivers again. We're talking about punchline rappers. Not many people can fuck with Rivers, man. Definitely. He's got an insane. Ability to do hit the some people like even the top top tier people they're consistently punching but they peak at the seven the eight out of ten yeah. rivers can hit those nine ten out of ten rip to scale fucking punches but yeah, like, yeah, when he had his trial and he done that he had a few bars in that that were just like room shakers that tryouts don't usually have yeah. even though he, he's not less he was a trial he's not a plot like he's battled a few yeah, of course, that, but yeah. he managed to transcend that's uh, it yeah, that's a new stage to develop his style. No, Rivers is good. Um, I'd like to see him battle more. Um, you better tell them my whole life's crazy. I'm from where young G's will shoot you in the hood and then upload the video online. Yeah, I'm in the grand daily. I Listen, I ain't talking about working in a care home when I say I'm pushing that white lady. <laughs> Crying pays me. Wait, this ain't church confession. <laughs> or you get stabbed in a steeple, like a blood sacrifice in a Catholic cathedral. <laughs> I got two hatchets I got from my Arab and Hebrew. They're my axes of evil. <laughs> 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 They're my axes of evil. I use them to crack your cerebral. Right. If you don't buy into my ideology, I got a violent policy. Try and follow me. I'll push the tom out front as cover. That's Scientology. Oh. Oh. Whilst I love Jay Ray and Jay Ray's brilliant, that wasn't for me the right clash from the second battle. I like to see Rivers battle the right person for him. And then even to battle Tony and Locksmith, I thought. You know, Tony and are, are, have done it. They're at that level when I think they're, for him and Rick Fiora to come in that straight away, which is a bit, bit of a lesson. You know what I mean? Not like, they did really well, but they lost it quite clear just because they were against two people who have done it. Yeah. So I think Rivers come in back with people who are really good, but not necessarily Tony Soul. If he does a couple more battles against really good punchers and yeah. he makes a couple classics, close battles, he's going to be then he's gonna be like one Would of you the like best see him in the game. Like someone like who? Like a name. So Rivers on on Don't Flop. Um, even just some, some of the better writers, even Frankie, someone like Frankie, okay. like the, the good, the top tier writers in Don't Flop. Yeah. That's it. That'd be sick for Rivers. I think me versus Rivers would be a good battle. I would do that. I said to him before. Um, I don't think he, we've both spoken about. It. I don't think he was on it at the time. Um, maybe one day. I see now. I'd see that as more of a gab thing. Okay. I wouldn't see that as something that would work for Don't Flop, but yeah, I'd, I'd personally think he'd be worth the battle. Okay. You know, just to go like... Yeah, that's Snoop, bro. You're off the Battle Rivers, man. Yeah, Let's get this set up, bro. Just a lot of corners and go punch for punch, you know what I mean? Yeah, it's, it's or it'll be a three-rounder, bro. Three-rounder, three though. Three three-rounder, one-rounder, whatever, man. Three-rounder would be good, though. I like three-rounders because you can rebuttal. And just, I think okay. a lot of people can't rebuttal. I'm, like, I'm not the best rebuttal, but I've got... Yeah, but you've got a chance to yeah, rebuttal. Yeah, I like having... No, I respect people that do rebuttals, man. Sometimes rebuttals, again, is like... It's it's think if they win rounds. Mm. Especially if you can, like, uh, rebuttal an angle. Yeah. If you rebuttal an angle, that's game over. When Tony yeah. rebuttal shot his angle yeah. in that yeah. round, he won the battle. Yeah. So he won the round straight away. Immediately. Okay. Anyone else you feed it? Just in general? Yeah, man. No, these newbies, man. We've got to give them some love, some credit, try and Does stir that? up some matches. Well, who's, who's, who's new? Who's new now? Well, you know, who's, 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 who do you think, you know, or think of some matches that you would like to see happen? Uh, people who, who are still on the up, like Bobby Rex, he's, he's wicked. Bobby Rex, uh, Bobby Rex, he's been doing it. Again, man. original style. Originals coming. coming against a big international who's yeah. also got a big personality and then yeah. pop off. Yeah, like, it's something that I, I want to see people getting pushed through these other Well, we worked, so he came in and made a big impact. Of course, man. And the one new comedy here, man. Okay, so. I that one. Yeah, shout out. Has he taken the judge loss apart from uh, on beat against Press One? 
He doesn't think oh, of us. There you go. Bobby Brown, he's, he's, do, he's doing it. Um, so there's, there's. I mean, I've, I've obviously got my sort of favourites who are already up there, like like the Souls and the Shocks and the Tonys. Yeah, yeah. You know, I think. Um, again, we're talking title shot and stuff. You know, yeah. and I think I think Harry's up there now. Harry Baker. Okay. I think he's he's just had about the clips and respect. The age has come back and he's he's doing his thing. Um, respect's going in. So I think I think respect. The I can see that. If I was to see it panning out, I'd say respect battles a big international at the next birthday weekend and then battle shots with a title check one. I can see that. Okay. Out. I reckon that's what will happen if I was to predict. Usually my predictions are right. Yeah, I respect him. I, he's a, I, he's, I like his style, but don't you think it's kind of a little bit unfair that he's come back after a big break and there's been people who've been putting in work? We were, we were talking about this in the car when we come out like, how are we judging these title shots and who deserves yes, it? What? I, I know what people will. I know why people would say respect for saying doesn't deserve it, but all you can say is when it gets to the day on the cash and the person takes the opportunity, then you can't really argue. He battled Tony, he had a very good battle with Tony. Yeah. Um, I personally had Tony taking it, but respect was punching a lot and a lot of people gave that to respect. Um, he battled Sirius Jones, other people, oh, he's just come back to me battling Sirius Jones, he beat Sirius Jones. And respect's fucking earned his stripes, man. People can't say that. Like, you know, Ten years ago, battling on the streets and yeah, like, yeah, making yeah, a name sure. freestyle, and that's Definitely. that's fucking strikes more than anyone's got, man. Yeah. So he took a hiatus. He took a, he, he took a long time out, but he's come back and he's shown that he can adapt. Um, it's a he hasn't tried hard to change his style. Okay, you know what I mean. I think that's cool. Yeah, no, like, I mean, he's, he's still himself. doing himself. He's yeah. not been like, oh, I've got to come back because everyone has been doing schemes and all this shit. So I'm gonna do that. No, he's not. He's just taking the obvious angles and doing them really well. Yeah, but then which, look, look at the other people that, that in that time that he's gone have been putting in work. They're rising and actually have been putting in work and you know keeping not saying keeping the air for flip, but you know they've been putting in their work, man. Like, yeah, you know, definitely. Like, no, I'm not saying I'd give him the title no. shot. I wouldn't, but yeah. I can see why they. Who do you think next for shops then? And and then let's get oh, obviously we've got, we've got on beat champion now. So mm-hmm. on beat so. on beat's gotta be press one versus Dallas or press one versus Bamlan. It's one of those two. Bamlan active. No, but I think if he came back, we wouldn't Bamlan again. He's he's been wicked. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I love the shot. I think press. I think press Dallas makes sense. I think Dallas the best. On beat outside of his battle, maybe natural as well. Natural's a shout. Okay. Natural's really good on beat battles. Um, but for the title, the non flop title, the shocks. I think I would love someone funny to have a go with it. There hasn't been a comedy battler for a while in that fray. Um, so I say the obvious ones would be Osh and Harry Baker. Okay. People who've been killing it the last few years. Um, outside of that, I think um, Quill's up there. Yeah. I wouldn't. I think his last few hasn't. He hasn't won though. That's my problem. Um, I, do, I do. Even people that killing that, I think winning is important. Like Raptor again, been doing well, but he's not winning battles. He's not winning battles. Um, I can't believe you haven't said that his name. Dialect is up there for me. He's done it for a little. Dialect again, yeah. putting loads of work. True. I think he's deserved it a long time. Yeah, ago. Dialect is definitely mm-hmm. up there. Um, so this is what I'm saying, so like, no, no disrespect to Shock's work, but then, where was Dalek's shot, like, what, so what, what was happening, like, he was killing it, doing yeah, it in smart hype trains. Okay, Shock's built a hype train, by consistently battling, and consistently punching heavy, yeah, yeah. making Put his presence work, well, yeah. and being around, and Dalek's kind of come back into more in the last few months, and now he's like, I'd say it's active again. Okay. So, I think, yeah, he's, he's got to be, it's just from what he's done for Don't Flop. What about Devonai Shock? Gemini's would make sense the most. To the point I think Gemini would have slightly edged shots for me. In, 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 I think Gemini would have got the next shot if he wanted it. But he always said, I don't want to battle for the title. Well, I battle for the title, bro. The title don't matter. That's secondary to winning the battle. You can be the champion. You don't have to celebrate that you're the champion. Just battle shocks for the title. That would be exciting. Gem shocks that we're talking about now, the last two years of battle rap, mm-hmm. that's the battle you want to see. Yeah. That's the one. So yeah, I'd say Gem shocks. Make a lot of sense. Okay. But you mentioned earlier about on the battle, Gem is another one. That'd be that's yeah. another one of my like on gem. If I had really? a target target people I want to battle, I forgot about him earlier, but targets of battlers I rate as punchers and writers, yeah, he'd definitely be one of them. Okay.
Y'all crafty shout out to Mad Dog TV every fucking time.